hello my beautiful ladies in the house my queens how are you all doing i hope you all are doing great so this is going to be a quick one if you're a woman in the house if you're a married woman in the house and you find out that your husband is cheating and his cheating attitude has you know is growing day by day like it has become unbearable <clears throat> for you please do not cry again Go and do this simple recipe, okay? Carry out these simple rituals and watch your husband gradually, gradually stop withdrawing himself from each and every one of his side chicks. So I'm not going to waste time with this video. So without being said, hello, my wonderful family. How are you all doing? It's your girl once again. Blessing. And in this channel, I try my best to bring to you all natural remedies that works in general, both spiritual-wise and health wise so if that's what you're looking for then this place is the right channel for you to stay if you're seeing my face for the first time do well to subscribe to this my youtube channel and also like my video as that will help me a lot and for my returning subscribers you all are my real and with this thank you so very much and god bless you so with that being said let's go right into, into the video so how are you going to stop your husband like separate your husband from his side cheeks how are you going to do that get yourself an egg so what i have on my hand here now is egg this is english egg okay that's um english egg i don't know what you call it it's just english egg okay now if you're also able to get native egg it's okay so when you get this native egg if you know your husband's side chick's name hmm let's take for instance your husband's name is a or a b c sorry a you write a b here i assume this to be someone husband's name a b okay now if you know your husband's side chick's name you write it underneath where you wrote your husband's name but in a situation whereby you do not know your husband side chick's name you write a to z that is a to z okay you write this a a to z you can also put it a a like this then to z in the spiritual name it means every person's name here on earth starts from a and ends to z like you, you when you count from a b c d to z somebody's name falls in those names okay so in the situation whereby you don't know that your husband's side chick's name that is always making him behave anyhow leave the house and do also maybe not, don't take care of you always sleep out or do things that he's not supposed to do in your marital home and you as his wife in fact, he, that 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 attitude has, you know, it, it it has it has gotten to the point that you're almost about giving up in that your marriage. Please don't do, don't give up. Do not allow them to take over your marriage from you. Rather, do this instead. Okay. So now, when you finish writing this on that egg, you're going to do this at midnight. Okay, you are going to do it at midnight, and before you do it, make sure. You, you stay in a place where you have T junction. T junction, I mean, is three roads junction. Three roads junction is what is called T junction. Crossroad is four roads junction, okay? So T junction is three roads junction. Now, when it's around 11.30 or maybe 11 p.m. in the night, you wake up, pick up your egg, make sure your husband is not around when you're doing this so he doesn't think you've started doing... Do you understand what I mean? You now pick up your egg and write your husband's name. If you know that his side chick's name that is making him misbehave, you write it after writing your husband's name. If you don't know your side chick's, your husband's side chick's name, you write A to Z with black marker. Please take note of that. It must be black marker. Do not use another color of marker. Okay? Then you now put it in your mouth like this and start praying. Start saying, you can now write maybe, let's say what you want between your husband and that person is separation you write separation okay you write separation 
if you also want them to fight quarrel you know like separate that's that's i for me i i i assume that's what you want as a married man you do not want your husband to be with another person so whatever you want to just write it you can just write all those things just in one word let's assume your let's take for instance you're writing separation you want your husband and that his side chick to separate or all his side, side chicks to separate from you want him to your husband to hate that his side chick all right you write it on this egg and start praying how you want the relationship to end immediately now after praying your intentions on this in this egg you now go outside make sure nobody sees you please when you're doing this make sure nobody not a single soul should step should set his or her eyes on you you now go outside and locate that three road junction which is steve junction when you get to that place you still stand there and pray for like one or two minutes and make your intentions pray how you want your husband to hate every other girl and love you and you alone so after praying after praying all your heart desires into the egg you now smash it and now say smash it on smash the egg on that three row junction on that three row junction and now say as you have broken this egg now so shall your husband's relationship with all that girls be broken now forevermore in the name of jesus christ amen you turn your back and go back to your house that is all it's very simple but it's super effective just do that okay do that and watch your husband attitude from that moment henceforth and see if it's the type that used to put his phone on silence maybe his phone will be ringing and it's his side chicks that that used to call him or maybe that he's calling him and he'll put his phone on silence he will either pick the call and tell them to stop calling him on phone or he will ignore the call entirely or maybe block them not as as many as they are that is how he will keep doing that's how he could keep doing until your husband ends up not having interest in any of those girls henceforth okay so please go and try this and come back and give us your testimony all right thank you and god bless you so my wonderful and beautiful kings and queens i've come to the end of this video if you appreciate this video please do well to like this my video as that will give me that will help me a lot and this is my channel and if you're seeing my face for the first time please do well to subscribe to this my youtube channel so that you will always be a member of this family and so that you will always be notified every time i upload new videos okay and for my returning subscribers and for my returning subscribers i see me god bless you so very much thank you i'll see you all in my next video peace